Hi everyone, I have a special video today. I think this is the first video that I do on the channel while I'm talking. And yeah, I'm gonna try to, to make more YouTube videos going forward after this. I'm not really sure how and when I'm gonna make those videos, but at least I'm gonna try <laughs> when I have time. But, but yeah, this is the first video I'm talking and I'm, I plan to do an unboxing of this new guitar that I got, which is pretty special to me, but this guitar went through so much to get here. Uh, a friend brought it to me from the United States and it's a big case, so we had to check the baggage and the air company lost the baggage. And when it arrived in my country, the, the customs office retained it and it was a pretty big headache and the, the customs office did the, the whole unboxing thing for me <laughs> but yeah I'm gonna still do it because that was my plan This is an Abazi Concept ME8. Wow, it's extremely gorgeous. I'm not really sure you can see it very well in this light, but. This ME8 is in the gentian blue finish, and it comes with an Okomi body and a Karina neck, and it has a roasted maple fingerboard. The neck profile is the Overform Plus that has a subtle teardrop shape. It is a little bit thinner on the lower strings and a little bit thicker on the high strings. It is a multi scale from 25 and a half inches in the higher strings and 27 and a half inches in the lower strings. It has stainless steel frets and individual string saddles in the bridge. Hip shot locking tuners, Fishman Fluence Abazi humbucker, and two Fishman Fluence single coil pickups. And it has this very beautiful two sheen finish that they do at Abazi Concepts. The bevel areas of the body are this very glossy finish. And the flat parts have this really cool matte finish. And it also comes with the Fishman rechargeable battery pack, so you don't have to use the standard 9 volt batteries. Let's try the guitar. Uh, I'm guessing first position is the full humbucker and then we have a push-pull which maybe selects between voice one and two. And as far as I know from the other Abazi guitars, uh, the second, second position is the split coil tone on the humbucker. And then we have the middle one, middle plus neck and then neck and I'm not sure if the the push pull does anything to the to these two pickups. Uh yeah the guitar came came like really stable out of the the case even though it went through like maybe two or three flights and it's all in tune. That that's really impressive. Uh yeah it came tuned in E B and then the six string, six string standard. I'm not really sure which voice is which here in the push pull because 
as far as I know, Tozen likes to, to leave like the standard setting with the, the volume pushed down as voice 2. So I, I'm guessing this is voice 2. And this is voice 1, which seems to be the higher output. I think I'm going to take some time to get used to the multi scale. I've been playing eight string guitars for about 10 years. I have a Schecter Hellraiser C8 and it's a regular scale, normal scale. So yeah, this is pretty new to me. So it's kind of weird to look at the guitar and then like the fan frets get really confuse me. <laughs> On the hands, you, you almost don't don't really feel it, but when you look down, you, you get kind of lost, at least for me. The neck profile, uh, from what I read on the website, it's like a subtle teardrop shape. It feels just a little tiny bit thicker on the, the higher strings and a little bit thinner on the, on the lower strings. It's pretty interesting. The neck axis is incredible. Oh, wow, it's just a, seems like such a well-constructed instrument. I mean, from the price, that's the least you could expect, right? Let's try some distortion on this. Position 2 has such an interesting split coil tone.
the volume pot is really easy to like accidentally hit it and it turns really easily <laughs> you gotta be careful with that This cut here makes this position, this playing position really comfortable, which is my preferred playing position. And most guitars that have like the input jack here, I can't really play in this position because it gets in the way. With the jack being like in the back of the guitar, it really helps. Wow, this is very comfortable. So yeah, I think I'm gonna leave the video where, where it is right now and I'll probably do another one in maybe a couple of months when I've had more time to play with this guitar and maybe update the, the review, but from playing it first time it seems like an extremely well built guitar and of course it is extremely expensive so for that price it's kind of really hard to recommend it. but. Yeah, it's an amazing instrument and it feels really expensive and it looks amazing. The two sheen finish is extremely beautiful, this binding here is amazing. Everything seem, seems like so really well thought out. I'm extremely happy with this this instrument and I think it's gonna motivate, motivate me to make more videos and play more and I think this is kind of what I was looking for. Motivation, yeah. It, it, it is a pretty expensive one, but yeah, it's it's one of those instruments that when you look at it, it makes you want to play, you know. And I think that that is really important to me, at least now. <laughs> so yeah, if this makes me play more guitar, I guess it's worth it. I'm not really sure, but Abasi MEA, incredible instrument. See you guys soon, bye bye.